come back from the Bodgers Ball, the 2012 Bodgers Ball. And one of the things I've won in the auction is this lovely grindstone, this water grindstone here. Uh, it, apparently it comes from France, and as you can see, the wheel is all over the place here. This is probably one of the lowest points, that's another low point, and so we've got to true it up. So how do you do it? It's very simple to true up a misshapen wheel like this. All you need is a long tube and you grind a 90 degree end, uh, angle right on the end and you hold it up on the tool rest and you pedal. There's something else I've been experimenting with and that's a drill, well it's an old drill bit just in a block of wood and because the drill bits are fluted and if you move it around every now and again it tends to cut quite a deep groove into the into the sandstone wheel. Not perfect for finishing off but to start taking the bumps and such like off it's, it's absolutely ideal because it's so small at the top. You use something bigger and the wheel can just grind to a halt as a bump comes round. Just like using a billet of wood on the pole lathe where, which is a little bit misshapen. Right. Uh, I've got Daniel here turning the grindstone into the tool rest and we're just going to put another sharp edge on the end here. And that's it. Here we go, start off getting the grindstone pedalling towards you and hold the bar onto the stone. So that's using the bar as you can see on a stone like this it's going to take some time but if you are just truing up the stone um, after you'd got it flat something like this really wouldn't take very long at all. So where did I put the other one? Here we go. This is a little drill bit here and you use it in exactly the same way. Get the wheel turning towards you. sharpen some tools, some axes and stuff on it, see how it works. But I've got to watch uh, the narrow bits because obviously these will wear more than the wider bits. But anyway, it seems to be working very well at the moment. Uh, the reason why the back leg is in my saw horse is because this is a round joint which someone has greased and as you treadle, this, this leg or this seat just tips over. So this is something I'll be sorting out uh, later on. What I'll probably do is to get a big block of wood, drill an angler hole through it and stick the leg through that. Anyway, let's see how it works. I've got a nice little broad axe here 
and uh, pedal towards myself. Not too fast or I will get covered in water. And yes, it's grinding away nicely. Not very quickly, but very safely. I'm, never, I'm not going to lose the temper of the tool doing it with this wheel here. And we can go in either direction, whatever suits you best. You do need to put quite a lot of pressure onto the tool.